Hi, welcome to Trisha's Makeup World. If this is your first time visiting my channel, hi, I'm Trisha. I'm 46. I absolutely love colourful makeup. And today I've got my hands on the new Cosmic Brushes Delicious Delights. I'm going to, to do two looks with it. It's the first impressions um, and we'll take it from there. I think my first look will do something quite simple, like um, a little... Look at the size and a bit of shimmer and then the second look will maybe go a little bit more i don't know <laughs> i haven't thought about it yet so i think the first color i'm going to go in with is this purple shade here and it's called jelly bean i'm going to just run along that tape like so and bring it over my lid I'm going to do the same on the other side. Just bring it. And do the same on the other side as well. It's got my palette from yesterday. I thought, right. I need to come on and I need to do a two look video. I think Cosmic Brushes, my first sort of seeing them was probably watching, um, I think probably Angelica Nienquist. And I think she had the Serenity Palace. Oh, I actually saw a few YouTubers with the Serenity Palette when it came out. And to begin with, you just could not get your hands on it. Then obviously she brought out the Muse one. I tried to get that. I failed miserably. I could not get that palette. Um, and then obviously she brought this one out. The Delicious Delights. The Muse one, when she brought that one out, I had it in my basket. I think everybody must have just been going crazy on the page. And it crashed. And I went to pay for it. It was no longer in my basket. I ended up with the Serenity palette, which... I do really, really, really like, but I was glad to get the Delicious Delights palette. I still would like to get the Muse one eventually when it comes back in stock. Now, the next colour I'm going to go in with, I'm going to go in with a, um, a more sort of fluffy one. I'm going to go in with this bright pink one, and that is called Smoothie. And I'm just going to just run along. That first shade just ever so slightly, like so. Do the same on the other side, just really lightly over the top. Just, just well, overlapping it, I say over the top, overlapping it, like so. And then we're going to go in with the, light, the lightest shade of pink, and that one is. Marshmallow. I really needed to wear my glasses. <laughs> um, and that, I'm going to go in with a, another brush and just lightly skim over, bringing it right onto the lid. Like so. Do the same on this side. So, and then I'm just going to go back in with that first darker shade, the Jelly Bean, just so that we're still not losing that. Swatches I will put in after the first look, and then so that you can see it. I think I think that's how we'll do it. Right, I should take this tape off. That looks okay. I'm going to run that jelly bean shade just halfway, I think, and we'll go in with a brighter pink shade. Mm. 
Yeah. Go like so. And then, now, the shimmers. I think I've got to start off with the, the one here, the lips. And I think we'll probably use candy floss as well. Yeah, I think that's the ones that I want to use. Well, maybe sprinkles as well. That looks cool. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> There's quite a lot here. Right, I think we're definitely going to go in with delicious. And we'll just... So, sort of halfway. A bit more. Bit of a blob of it there, not I. <laughs> there we go. I was really happy when the palette finally came. I was like, great, I could do another video. Now, I'm going to go in, yeah, with this one here, Candy Floss. And just lightly. In the corner I'm just going to use that shade again, that really light colour, like so. And then I'm going to go in with my mascara, find it, oh, this one again. Still using this sun kiss one, I really need to get a new one. She ordered a mascara off that Timu. Let's see what it's like. Okay. First look, I'm going to use these ones, they're KISS ones that I have, um, I quite like them, I picked them up the other day, I thought mm, they're quite nice, I've actually got another pair as well, they're quite nice, these ones, so usually they use, these are my absolute favourites, the tie lash, we'll probably use those ones in the second look, TL3. thought about doing a video with my Jenna Tutorials palette that I have, the new one, the Reloaded. I've got our original palette. I thought we could look, I could maybe do like a two look using the two palettes. And, well, she says that you could use the eyeshadows and everything on your brows, which I have done today, actually. I thought I could maybe do something like that. I don't know. lashes out. Right, I'm going to go in with my Jenna Tutorials palette to use like blush and highlighting. I think I'm going to go in with this orangey shade here. So it's called Yankee Doodle. <laughs> So 
I'm just going to use a little of this one on the bottoms here. Like that. Oops. Turn it down a bit. This is a little bit too bright. That's better. And then my lips, I think I'm going to go in with a Jolie Beauty thing. This one, I'm not sure. Cannot read the name on it, I'm sorry. And that is look number one. And um, what I'll do is I will go off and take this off, and I'll come back and we'll do look two. See you soon. Bye. and I'm back again so I think we're going to do a cut crease to try and get some more of these colours on I haven't even got a clue how I'm going to start this I really don't <laughs> um, I think I want to go in with the <laughs> this colour here, yeah. I might go in with the green one here, the dark one. going with this blue one here. So I'm just gonna go over them all just to intensify them a bit more. Well, that yellow limey sort of colour, and we'll get that in here. And then I'll go back into the blue. 
No, where's the last? Is that? Oh, I'll just top up to get it there and where I've got it on the brush. The green shade. Okay. So. Then what I'm going to do is just take that fluffy one and I'm going to go in with the white from the palette and just try and blend that first colour a bit. I might actually mix a, a bit of them together just to lighten it a bit, a bit. just to give it a bit more of a blend. And then I'm going to go in with that lighter green here, that one, and just go for that first that green just half and half, just try and blend it a bit. Like so. And then the blue one. We're going to do the same, we're going with that lighter shade. Just and then we'll go back over the colours again. We'll do yellow. Then the green, then the blue, and then I'm just going to again go over them all. You just keep doing that process until you're happy with what you've got basically. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with a flat brush and I've got a P. Louise base here. I'm just going to put a little bit on the back of my hand just to get my shape. I just want to get a little bit on the tip of your brush on, brush on both sides and then I'm just going to go in and just start creating the shape that I want. Do the same on the other side. Sometimes I'll go in with a like a cut carver or a micellar water to do this, you know, process first sort of thing. But sometimes I just like to go in and just create my shape straight away. So 
make sure that they're moving on both sides. Okay. Now we'll go in with some shimmers. Um, I think we will start off with this one again, the nice uh, iridescent age or white. going to go in with maybe the green, this green one here. I don't think I'm going to go in with that. I think I'm going to go in with the purple shade here instead. Hmm, that's better. It kind of ties it in a bit. I'll just go in with my fingers just to brighten up a bit. So, and then under my eyes, I think we'll probably just try and copy what I did, like, so the sort of yellowy shade at the inner bit. If you saw the NYX Barbie collection, I'm a bit disappointed with it. So, one of the YouTubers I was watching in the flash up, I think they felt the same, kind of went like, hmm, it wasn't over. I remember when they did the Avatar collection, I thought that was really cool. Um, but this Barbie one, I'm a bit disappointed. They thought, hmm, is that it? <laughs> and then we'll do the blue on the end. I do really like um, Glam Lights Rick and Morty collection, that looks really cool. But I think I said in my previous video, I'm quite put off. I've heard sort of mixed reviews about their customer service, see, but I'm like, mm, maybe you should try it on. that light shade again in the middle or like in the corners of my eye 
If there's any, you know, palettes that you want to suggest, please do. I'm open to suggestions. I do like my indie brands. Um, right, let's see. That looks great. All right. Now, mascara again. I'm still using <laughs> I need to get a new one. I really quite fancy trying Gloss Gods. I believe they're another Swedish indie brand. Again, I think it was probably Angelica Nienquist. Watch and her. I thought, oh, they look quite good. I can't remember what they're new. Something Skies Collection, I believe, is what they're called. Right, I'm going to go, I'm going to use my um, tatty lashes this time round, TL3. My foundation is just the same as what I had on in the previous uh, look. My brows are the same as well, I just used the Jenna Tutorials palette. Thinking though, doing it, yeah, maybe like a two look with the two Jenna tutorial palettes that I have. Oh, maybe should have pre opened them beforehand, I can't get the tape off. <laughs> Oh my god, I should have opened these beforehand. <laughs> oh yeah, I really should have done this beforehand. Note to sell. Open eyelashes before you start video. <laughs> right, I've got them out. Glue's probably going to be stuck now. I'm about to be glue my lid. Oh, the lashes on. Right, I think we'll go in with the Jenna Tutorials like reloaded palette and I'm going to use the orange shade on my cheeks again because I quite like an orange blush. I'm going to go in with this bottom highlight again and just a little I'm just going to run my finger up it just a little bit so it's just a bit too Uh, 
we'll go in with it. And it's another Julie Beauty one. And let's get again, I can't read the bottom of it. We'll find out. And that is the second look using the new Cosmic Brushes Delicious Delights. I have to say I really really like it a lot. I will probably come back and do more looks with this um, again. Um, it's lovely. It's what I expected from obviously having the Serenity palette. The shimmers are lovely. The multi-chromes are lovely. The mattes are really, really nice. The blend really, really well. Yeah, I really like the palette a lot. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you liked what you've seen, please subscribe to the channel. It does help. And I will see you again in the next video. Bye.